As the golf season draws to a close, golf courses make plans to preserve and protect their grounds for next spring. And as they do so, managers and grounds crews have plenty of decisions to make. Those choices can be environmentally friendly. New Center Maine's Sam Rogers takes us to Bangor Municipal Golf Course, which is aiming for environmental excellence. The leaves are falling off the trees at Bangor Municipal Golf Course, a sign the season is ending but not ending without some recognition. We've always felt that we should be the leaders uh, in whatever we do. And when it comes to environmental practices, we wanted to make sure that uh, we put that out there. And so the course is a renewed member of the Audubon Cooperative Sanctuary Program. Welcome for using proper environmental practices. But what we're doing is what we can do. For a golf course to become a member, it needs to meet certain criteria one being wildlife and habitat management. By just letting some areas literally go, go wild, uh, it's amazing what it does for the environment. The course has set aside more than seven acres of land for wildlife, doing its part for more than just players. We are just more than just a golf course. We're, we're you know, doing our part as um, members of the community. A member of the community that can get a bad reputation Golf courses misjudged on their impact. We're not hurting your environment. We're helping it, if anything. Another criteria, using safe chemicals and irrigation systems, met here in Bangor with some assistance from the Environmental Protection Department in town. We actually had a leg up being a municipality. If you want to enjoy the experience of playing at Bangor Municipal, time is running out. Due to weather, the course will be shutting down for the season in the coming weeks. In Bangor, Sam Rogers, New Center, Maine.